Hi boys and girls, today we are going to learn about the days of the week. Our content objective is, I can use numbers to help me put something in order. Our language objective is, I can write the number for each day of the week and put them in order. Now, how many days of the week do we have? If you look up here, how many days of the week do you see? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are seven days in a week. If you look over here, you see our calendar and you see the days of the week. The days of the week help us stay organized throughout the week, throughout the month, and throughout the year. They help us plan our activities for each day. Now we are going to do the Days of the Week song. If you remember the song, you can sing along. Ready? Let's go. Days of the Week, boom, boom. Days of the Week, boom, boom. Days of the Week, Days of the Week, Days of the Week, boom, boom. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday, Days of the Week. Boom, boom, days of the week, boom, boom, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, boom, boom. All right, that's our song. How many days are in a week again? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sunday's the first day, Monday's the second day, Tuesday's the third day, Wednesday's the fourth day, Thursday's the fifth day. Friday's the sixth day, and Saturday is the seventh day of the week. Do you remember our Very Hungry Caterpillar book? Well, in our book, the Hungry Caterpillar followed the seven days of the week. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What is the first day of the week? Do you remember? If you said Sunday, you are correct. Sunday is the first day of the week. What is the second day of the week? Monday. What is the third day of the week? Tuesday. What is the fourth day of the week? Wednesday. What is the fifth day of the week? Thursday, what is the sixth day of the week? Friday, what is the seventh day of the week? Saturday. All right, those are our seven days of the week and they are all in order. Do you remember what happened on the first day, which was Sunday? Well, on the first day on Sunday, the very hungry caterpillar popped out of his egg. Do you remember what happened on Monday, the second day? Well, he was very hungry. Do you remember what he ate? He ate through one apple. And then what did he eat through on the third day, Tuesday? He ate through two pears. And then what did he eat through on Wednesday, the fourth day? He ate through three plums. And then what did he eat on Thursday, the fifth day? He ate through four strawberries. And then what did he eat through on Friday, the sixth day? He ate through five oranges. And then on the seventh day was Saturday. Do you remember all the foods he ate through? He ate through a lot of foods. He ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, 
one piece of pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. Hey boys and girls, I want you to have someone help you write down the seven days of the week words onto a piece of paper. Once you have those words written on a piece of paper, I want you to write a number next to each word. So I want you to write a one next to the word Sunday because Sunday is the first day of the week. Number two next to Monday because Monday is the second day of the week. A number three next to Tuesday because Tuesday is the third day of the week. A number four next to Wednesday because Wednesday is the fourth day of the week. A number five next to Thursday because Thursday is the fifth day of the week. And a number six next to Friday because Friday is the sixth day of the week. And last but not least, a number seven next to the word Saturday because Saturday is the seventh day of the week. Once you have a number next to each week word, I want you to cut out the seven days of the week words and put them in order. So um, if you want to challenge yourself, you can cut out the words and write the numbers on the back instead. So below, I have an example of the work. I wrote down the words and then me and Kayo, we labeled the numbers on them. I had Kayo put them in order from first all the way to the last day of the week. When you are done, boys and girls, you can take a picture of it for me and send it to me to show me your days of the week put in order from first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, the seventh day. All right, boys and girls, I look forward to seeing it. Goodbye.